Hey guys, Nico Mercurius here. And in this video, we're going to talk about insanely profitable crypto trading techniques that I would say 95% or more of traders just don't know about. They don't understand. And um, number one is trading with leverage. A lot of people hear that leverage is dangerous. Stay away from leverage. In fact, if you go in, on YouTube and you look at or watch any of the videos from some of the top crypto people out there, they're not really traders. They're talking about crypto. They might be knowledgeable about blockchain technology and crypto. And they're talking about all the different altcoins and, and Bitcoin and stuff like that. But they don't really understand trading. But they will tell you, stay away from leverage. Leverage is a good way to wreck your account and lose money. But leverage is also the only way to ever get rich. It's the only way to ever get rich quicker. I shouldn't say it's the only way because you can possibly get rich slow. I just don't understand why anybody would want to. You don't really live long enough to get lit rich really slowly like the save your dollars and save your paychecks every week method. Unless you start like at 14 or 15 years old and you do it until you're 50 or 60, yes, you can accumulate some wealth that way. But most of my viewers, the people watching this right now, you might already be well into your 30s, 40s, 50s, 60s, 70s, 80s. I don't know how old you are, but I will tell you this. If you want to make a lot of money in a short period of time, you have to understand leverage and trading with leverage versus just buying and holding is really simple. If you bought one Bitcoin right now and Bitcoin doubled between now and the bull market top at the end of this year, that means you have to wait almost a whole year and it might go up 100% from where it's at now. That means if it's $60,000 today, it might hit 120,000. Okay, that's pretty good in one year. That's a 100% gain, right? That's pretty good. That's more than the stock market's gonna pay you. But if you understand leverage and you bought one Bitcoin right now and you did the same thing, you waited a year, but instead you went long with leverage, let's say 10X leverage, and Bitcoin just doubled in value from 60,000 to 100,000, you would make that extra 60,000 times 10, $600,000 in the same time frame by just being at 10X leverage and understanding what that is. So what it really is, guys, for those of you who may not understand, it's like buying a house. Most of, most people can understand the concept, right? Let's say you want to buy a $500,000 house here in Florida. The average price is about 500K. You got to put down 20%. That's, that's normal, right? That's a hundred thousand dollars that you have to save up. Well, that's much better than saving $500,000. That could take you decades to save that kind of money. Most people can't do it. So the bank allows you to put down five, 10, 15, 20%. And they will loan you the rest. That's leverage. So you're now controlling a $500,000 house with only 10% or 20% down. That's leverage. Now, if the house goes up in value, uh, let's just say 10% a year over the next 10 years, that means in 10 years, that house is now worth a million dollars. Well, who gets all that equity? You or the bank? You do. So you just made an additional $500,000 from your initial $100,000 down payment. All right. So if you wanted to, you could sell that house and pay off the first mortgage and put all that profit in your pocket, or you could refinance the property, pull all that equity out tax free. That's about 500 K after paying off the first mortgage tax free in your pocket. And you just started with 100 K. Now you can take that 500 K plus the 100 K that you had that 600 K and go now and buy six more houses with a hundred thousand down each. That's leverage. That's how you. That's how you go from a little to a lot in a much shorter period of time. Uh, so now you got $3 million with real estate. You started with a hundred thousand, took about a decade. Uh, try saving $3 million in 10 years and see how that works out. So, uh, leverage is definitely the way to go to there. Um, also, uh, futures contracts versus just trading BTC. Well, trading, uh, Bitcoin on a spot wallet or a spot account is basically trading with no leverage. Trading uh, Bitcoin futures contracts allows you to control more uh, with less money up front. And same with leverage, guys. You can you can control $10,000, $20,000, $50,000 or $100,000 with $1,000 in your account, kind of like options trading in the stock market with less risk. So um, I, I like to I like to say, you know, is this is this easy? Well, it's like learning a new language. It's like if I were to say that you would make $500,000 at the end of this one year, maybe it would just be a contest. If you learned a new language fluently and you did it within a 12 month period, you would get 500 K. Would you take me up on that? Would you do that? If, if that was the deal, would you take the time to learn the new language knowing you're going to get 500 K at the end of 12 months? The answer is probably yes, because you probably want to learn a new language anyway, but now you have an incentive. 
Now, what would you do to learn that new language to get that 500K? Would you hire a coach, uh, a, a language coach, uh, someone who speaks the language you want to learn to get on Zoom with you like this, you know, three times a week, maybe come to your house and sit down with you and help you pronunciate the words and give you, you know, uh, you know, demonstrate what it would be like if you were sitting in a restaurant in that country and how to ask for the meal and how to ask to go to the bathroom and ask for a drink of water and ask someone what their name is. Once you learn the language or at least the basics and you can actually speak fluently, even if it's broken, even if it's not excellent. In other words, you could get by in that country just by understanding the basics of that language and you would get 500K. I would say that that's equivalent to learning how to trade. If you can just become basic. In other words, you don't even have to become fluent. You just have a basic understanding of how trading works. You can make 500K in 12 months. So is it worth it to do it? Yes, I would say it's worth it because not only could you make that amount of money, there's really no limit to how much you can make. Once you understand the language, the more fluent you get at it, the better you get at it, the more money you will make at it. Kind of like if I said, would you be willing to learn how to play the guitar or learn how to play the piano if you were guaranteed one hundred to five hundred thousand dollars at the end of one year if you could just learn that skill? I think most people would do that. But guess what, guys? You could learn how to play one song on the piano and blow your friends away at the next party by just learning just one song. Someone says, oh, can you play this? You might say, no, I don't know how to play that. I only know that one song. You would still be pretty impressive, right? Uh, same with the guitar. Could you just learn one one chord one song maybe your favorite song and really impress your friends next time you see a guitar just pick it up and start wailing away and because you got that one tune down you could do that but imagine if you got really good at it and you learn how to play so that you can play any song anytime you could probably make money doing that you could get paid to do that right just like the piano you could you could become a concert pianist and if you got really good at it you could make millions and millions there's no limit to how much you can make when you learn a skill like trading, it's like learning a new language, but the difference with trading is, is you can do this in addition to any other thing that you could possibly be doing at the same time and create a six figure, even seven figure income in your spare time just by learning this one new language. So guys, uh, if you want to learn the language of trading, you want to understand the basic understanding of it, send me a message, click one of the links below. I'm sure that I have some resources down here below this video that's going to take you to either a webinar you can register for where I'm trading live, showing you exactly how we do this step-by-step. Step. You can also join our mastermind. You can ask me questions about how uh, that would look for you. If that was something you were interested in doing, you can comment below this video or try to get in touch with me, send me a message or get on our next webinar. Be happy to show you.